in the name of God hello dear colleagues I'm so happy to see your presence in today meeting thank you very much for joining us in this meeting today uh, I really appreciate your presence uh, today we are going to be uh, in this meeting about the uh, standard questionnaire that has been prepared in the uh, field of Mizraj research uh, Professor Murtaza Mujahedi, University Professor, Assistant Professor of Pabal University of Medical Sciences in Iran uh, is going to present uh, his lecture today and introduce us these standard questionnaire to just get more familiar in this questionnaire and uh, their value and their Applicable, uh, their uh, applications in the field of massage research. Uh, as we have discussed it before in previous sessions, uh, all of us uh, need to uh, just get more focused on the uh, standard uh, methodology in the field of massage research. And uh, we have to do uh, uh, our research uh, based on uh, standard uh, assessment tools uh, especially for the assessment of the misage, we need to have a common point and just, just use a unified and uh, standard uh, method for assessment of misage in our research just to be uh, comparable such uh, studies and uh, to be a more reliable and valu uh, valuable and uh, just to be shared in uh, different colleagues from all over the world and so uh, this is the importance of uh, such a unified methodology that would be uh, more in more details will be uh, presented by Professor Mujahidi as you know Dr. Mujahidi is the focal point of uh, Mizaj research uh, in our country and um, uh, I would like to invite him just to start his uh, lecture. Dr. Mujahidi we are at your service. Okay. Okay. Um, um, hello, everybody. Uh, everybody, and uh, good uh, um, good afternoon and good evening in India. Um, and I hope uh, your health in uh, each country as you are. Um, uh, I am starting my presentation and will uh, present you my uh, opinions uh, and the title of this uh, uh, meeting is about the standard message questionnaire. Uh, at the first uh, uh, I would like to um, uh, have a memory of my wise teacher review uh, reviver of Persian medicine in Iran uh, in a contemporary uh, century and the late Dr. Mohammed Mehdi Esfahani uh, may God have mercy on him uh, and uh, we have the fourth uh, monthly webinar uh, on Mizaj research uh, and the title of the webinar is about the uh, um, introduction of the standard Mizaj questionnaire <coughs> And we, we have a lot of uh, content to tell to you, but we don't have enough time. And um, I had to short my uh, some, some sentences. According to the historical text, Yunnan medicine uh, flourished in the ancient Persian civilization using the power of the Persian scientists and the experience of uh, Indian medicine and other medical schools. Persian ha has been the uh, cradle of promoting this school for uh, centuries. Many of these um, authentic texts are in Arabic or Persia, <coughs> Persian, which have been written by Iranian physicians um, residing uh, in Iran or India. Uh, therefore, the school is called Persian medicine in Iran. Uh, and <clears throat> uh, with uh, valuable scientific exchanges between Iran and India, Balkan countries have long benefited from each other medical schools and uh, Persian medicine has been promoted through the use of the experience of master Indian physicians. 
with the advent of Islam in the India uh, subcontinent. Uh, the school is in India uh, flourished more to the extent that it served the health of the people along with other traditional Indian medicine. The school with the wisdom of Indian scholars uh, from some reason named Yunani Medicine in India. Uh, over the past two centuries, due to Iran's uh, so socio-political con uh, conditions, the direct relationship with the former Persian medicine um, uh, hakims in Iran has been cut off. Uh, what is now available from this med medical school in Iran is only the text from the past centuries. But in India, with the wisdom of scholars like Hakim Ajmal Khan, uh, Abdul Hamid, etc., uh, the school con continued to uh, survive uh, and was transferred to the new generation. Uh, currently, there are some Hakims in India who have learned their knowledge not through university, but through the uh, Hakims before themselves. Uh, and therefore, we expect uh, they do their diagnosing and treating uh, disease based on principles of Yunnan medicine. Unfortunately, the number of these Hakims uh, is declining in, uh, and with the passing of each one of them, uh, then one of the potentials of systematically uh, diagnosing and treating based on the Yunnan Persian medicine is lost. Uh, given the uh, uh, 40 uh, to 5, uh, 40 to 5, 15 uh, years of the uh, um, uh, 30 to uh, 50 uh, years of the uh, experience of establishing uh, Hamdan University and other educational and research center, centers in India, uh, it is expected that these centers have taken essential steps in standardizing uh, the diagnostic indices and uh, treatment method of Yunani medicine using the personalized experience of master scholars, Hakims, and modern method of standardization of diagnostic and treatment indices in the medical sciences. Uh, <clears throat> An important point, uh, the main uh, identity of Yunnan medicine in the individual differences that is defined by the basis of the mizaj uh, and its uh, subsets. Uh, we should to uh, deliberately use the term of mizaj and don't use uh, miza, uh, temperament, temperament instead of it. Uh, the basic uh, principle of mizaj in Yunnan medicine has, has much in common with the idea of personalized medicine. Personal medicine does not have a general ap uh, approach to the individuals due to its unique approach to any person. Uh, based on the Mesa story, Yunani um, adjusted the management of Yunani medicine and personal medicine adjusted the management of the diagnosis and treatment based on the Mesa group Why, considering individual differences. Uh, the group approach uh, in personalized medicine seems more practical and cost benefits in, in the, uh, the future, uh, maybe. Uh, by the scientific approach uh, of Mizad ability in uh, distinguishing individual to the defined group in a con uh, community, the message based personalized med medical model can be introduced to the medical science research centers. Uh, the main need to implement this strategy is to standardize the general and or, uh, organ diagnostic indices of mesaj and its uh, subsets, including basic or primary mesaj, secondary mesaj, uh, healthy mesaj, uh, and this temperament which uh, that uh, that we named it sue mesaj, etc. Uh, to achieve this, we need to have a strategic and a target studies to pro prove the uh, nature of the message and the more importantly to develop standard message uh, identification scales. Without the uh, frustration of long time research and without expecting to achieve great results in a short time. 
the main need to implement this strategy is to standardize general and um, organ diagnostic indices of measles and its uh, subsets. Uh, we tell it that uh, sentences. Because the kinds of the studies take a long time and their results are gradually uh, complementing each other. Mm, the main question that if we claim to be a holistic med medical uh, school, why, how when to we come up with a standard method or tool to systematize this school so far? For, dom for uh, domain of mesas and its subdomains as the main axis of diagnosis in Persian and Yunnan medicine. For domain of uh, nose and uh, ishal and the subdomains as the main axis of diagnosis in Yunnan medicine and uh, treatment in Yunnan medicine and Persian medicine. Do we have any standard diagnostic method to, to or scale that are approved and used by our academic centers? We don't have now. Uh, have we ever taken serious steps to standardize diagnostic misogyny disease? No. Have we scientifically examined the relationship between the mizad indices and the exact determina determined mizad? No. Uh, what is the weight of each of the various mizad indices to uh, determine the mizad of each individual? How do we determine the mizad in many people uh, who have uh, uh, conflicting um, uh, indicators or indices? How many standardized mesage determination scale are available for, for use in mesage research projects, uh, which has gone through all the standardization steps? Uh, let's have a look at the general concept of Yunani medicine or Persian medicine. According to the written sources of Yunani medicine, many diagnoses of various diseases and uh, even the treatment of them de depends on the diagnosis of the uh, whole body mesas and uh, so the mesas of involved organs. A part of a health maintenance recommendation suggested based on the mesas, even for healthy people, uh, therapeutic uh, prescription and instructions depend on the mesas of patients. In the healthy states, um, nine mesas groups, general or as for as for any organ, um, could be considered, including, as you know, all of you know these uh, sentences: one te one temperate mesas, for simple mesas, hot, cold, wet, and dry, and for combined mesas, hot and dry, hot and wet, cold and dry, and uh, cold wet. Uh, in the um, disease state, uh, uh, disease message will be our distant parliament, also a message will be added to the healthy one, including uh, eight simple and four combined so message with the excess of matter. So a message with excess of matter include hot dry so a message, yellow by dominancy, hot wet so a message, uh, sanguine dominancy, cold dry so a message, black by dominancy, and cold wet so a message, phallic dominancy. In addition to these message groups, there are different messages based on the health and illness state, age, and sex. In this regard, each of the diagnosis of mesage, healthy mesage, so a mesage, with or without matter, uh, organ mesage, general mesage, primary mesage, secondary mesage, and sex mesage uh, require their own diagnostic standard. Uh, perform, um, um, performing treatment require the standardization of various treatment steps. How to find out the time of the matter, the matter knows. Uh, how to different how, how how to differentiate between the patients home uh, who, uh, who uh, this is uh, humor has enough nose or not what is the standardized diagnostic tool of measured indices such as uh, pul palpation malmass color pulse urine etc how is the situation of the uh, afro, uh, aforementioned uh, diagnosis? 
Diag diagnosis in uh, in the tr traditional medicine sources, um, most of the diagnosis in the traditional medicine sources are presented qualitatively. And most of the diagnoses are done using a group of various indices that they are overlap with each other. Priority and weight of the indices aren't mentioned clearly in our uh, text. The, the prices method for index evaluation have not been uh, stated in the most of the cases. No solution has been explicitly uh, proposed when some indices are uh, contradictory or overlapped. How do traditional medicine uh, therapies now diagnose? As you know, they, uh, they diagnose by their own, without any uh, agreement between each other in the world, in the India, in the Iran, and other countries. This is now agreed upon a standardized questionnaire or clinical method or a standardized mechanical tool for practitioners and researchers in the field of diagnosis according on Yunani or Persian medicine. Every therapist or researcher work on, uh, worked more on personalized preference or the uh, or on the measles or disease diagnosis based on Yunani or Persian medicine. In the field of um, biostatistic and uh, psychometrics um, uh, argue that if the concept of basic principles of a uh, discipline such as the principles of Yunani medicine and its uh, indices don't have at least uh, uh, unambiguous there is double the doubt that about its truth. And uh, diagnosis in researchers. Do the lack uh, of access to the standard method or tools for results determination uh, in the related researchers. It is done through most of the researchers have categorized the uh, participants uh, uh, through four group of uh, sanguine, bile, um, uh, phalic, and black bile, yellow bile and black bile. Most papers from India um, are um, wrote about this uh, uh, view. Uh, this qu qu quadru uh, quadruple uh, state is related to the patients of swim results. Uh, which matter, uh, situation of the individuals with temperate or simple method is not clear in this research. Due to the aforementioned issue, results from the reported uh, researches are heterogeneous and contradictory. Uh, this is a caution here that if this trend uh, continues in the near future, Systematic reviews and meta-analysis studies will undermine the identity and uh, essence of Persian or Yunani medicine. Research topic-based concepts, tools, clinical trials. Um, what about these? Lack of access to the standard diagnosis tool in Yunani and Persian medicine had lead researchers to conduct a clinical trial studies based on conventional medicine diagnoses. These researchers, um, on the basis of allopathic diagnosis, uh, investigating the effect of functional drugs uh, on identifying the Yunnan medicine. Now, what is the role of the? Uh, what is the role of, although this, uh, uh, the, uh, although this uh, approach is very uh, applicable, in, it will not approve the nature of uh, identification of Yunani or Persian medicine. Outmost, this will introduce the Yunani medicine, uh, uh, Persian medicine as a school of herbal medicine. Yunani medicine will be known as a herbal medicine school. Unfortunately, it's going to this, uh, not as a holistic medicine school that we have claimed from ancient to now. Practical suggestion um, is that establishing a team of biostatistics, the, the biostatistician, 
psychometrics and a Persian or Uranium specialist to de design the fundamentals of the diagnostic scale standardization. Formation of research team on standardization of Uranium medicine diagnostic the diagnostics indices among Uranium specialists. Union medicine specialist. Determine the diagnostic uh, repository and create, uh, create a database for typical individuals in each region based on the Union medicine diagnosis with the appropriate sample size by the executing team to provide better and more access for researchers. Inclusion of two compulsory or of uh, optional um, assessment psychometry uh, courses or setting up one week workshop on psychometric method in Yunnan or Persian medicine. MISAD uh, is one of the most applicable concepts of diagnosis, treatment, and health recommendation of Yunnan and Persian medicine. There is a lot of the diversity, the diversity of indices and complexity of MISAD's diagnosis method. Nowadays, we don't have any standard method by agreement uh, of uh, practitioners for measles identification. The access to standard diagnosis scale is a strategic priority of the school. It's a very important and strategic priority. Uh, 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 from uh, now to uh, some minute, I will introduce some um, a standard uh, um, questionnaire that we have uh, um, um, designed and done in Iran by our colleagues. And unfortunately, uh, um, 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 until now, uh, as our uh, best research, we don't know, we don't have informed uh, from any standard questionnaire and checklist or method or tool from Indian uh, colleagues and other countries about MESA's identification. Uh, of course, there are some uh, uh, performa and f some uh, questionnaire, but we don't have we don't have now any uh, method of the, the, the designment of them, and um, um, we don't have any article uh, about the method of standardization and the uh, and designing of that questionnaires. Uh, we, we have some uh, um, project in Iran development and kilometric properties of the diagnosis tools for wet and dry temperament of stomach in Persian medicine, uh, development and kilometric of diagnostic tools of cold and warm temperament of stomach in Persian medicine, and uh, development and kilometrics of diagnostic tools for warm and cold temperament methods of liver in Persian medicine. Uh, the, this project, uh, uh, most of this project are um, um, is, uh, done and approved in the um, uh, Iranian Health uh, Ministry of Health, and um, we are um, um, collecting the results. And it, it's their questionnaires is available in Persian language in Iran. And uh, just now we are trying to um, submit and publish their um, articles as the reference, uh, uh, the reference of these questionnaires. Uh, development and kilometric of diagnostic tool of wet and dry massage of liver. Uh, in, and other is uh, uh, design and kilometric evaluation of a diagnostic tool for warm and cold massage of uterus. Uh, design and validation of diagnostic protocol of melancholic distemperament. Uh, and um, other questionnaire we, we are doing for about the tadabir ma'kur wa mashroub for eating and uh, drinking um, uh, recommendation uh, uh, according to Yunnan medicine. We have a standard questionnaire uh, in the Persia, Persian language um, and uh, for uh, drinking, for eating, and uh, inshallah in the future we, we will design and uh, validate uh, um, uh, another uh, questionnaire for uh, other uh, lifestyle recommendation of Persian or Yunnan medicine. Uh, the first um, standard questionnaire in Iran is 10 item. Uh, they, they named it Mujahidi Mizaj questionnaire. That is uh, the, the original language in, in Persia. And uh, um, 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 the, the steps of uh, design and validation 
uh, of the uh, standard questionnaire um, is uh, near 10, um, about 10 steps that I um, uh, summarized it uh, in here, a step of design and validation. Uh, item generation is a, 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 a independent uh, project that uh, we uh, use the uh, intervention with ex ex specialists, with people, and uh, research and search in their textbooks or textbooks and gather the indices and the uh, introductions and definitions and other things about the mizaj, for example, about the subject that we have. We want to uh, design a, qu a standard question for it. Uh, uh, another step is the reliability process. Reliability process means when you design a question uh, for uh, asking uh, of people, uh, it question the result, the, the um, uh, um, <laughs> the the, the response of to the, the that questionnaire that that question ha, had had should be stable. Uh, for example, uh, it when uh, in the first step um, I I answer the question. Um, okay, I am for example I am a very very happy for example, and after two weeks maybe I answer the question I am I am not very happy. It is it it this question isn't reliable. The reliable question is that uh, my response to the uh, question be sustained and without any change. Of course, um, um, some some situation change uh, during time. Uh, with, I don't uh, mention to them. Validity process is the second uh, uh, major process of the validation of questionnaire. Uh, content and face validity needs. Uh, content and face validity means the the um, uh, viewpoint of the experts and the people about the the questions. The, each by one, each one by one of the que questions of the questionnaire had to be uh, under view of experts. And then um, we do a, 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 a some steps of project, uh, and we name it constructed validity. Uh, it needs some analysis and some words, and it uh, needs a diagnosis of expert as gold standard for for uh, the validation. And uh, in the end, we determine the cutoff points of the questionnaire. Uh, uh, here is the uh, English translation of uh, 10 item message questionnaire, uh, uh, but uh, um, it is uh, uh, the translation of the questionnaire that um, uh, uh, is in the uh, article. And for practical use in the English uh, language region, uh, it needs to translate to that language by the uh, met, uh, scientific method. Uh, the original language of this questionnaire and other question in there, uh, of methods that we design and uh, standardized in Iran is Persia. And although it may have been translated into English in this, re re in this reference article, but uh, uh, in order to use in the, any region except Persian language, the questionnaire must be translated and localized by the scientific scientific method of translating the questionnaire into the native language of that region. Um, uh, the steps of, uh, for the uh, scientific translation uh, step is uh, that um, uh, organized research team from both languages, uh, translation from the or or original language into the target language, Two or more uh, freelance translator um, should translate it to the um, another language. Uh, <laughs> items should be clear and uh, concise uh, to the understood by the public. Translators should not have prior knowledge of the questionnaire. Uh, three step. Uh, 
um, completion and uh, adaptation of translations under the supervision of the researchers have been done. Uh, a meeting or meetings should be held and the difference between the original version and the translation should be, uh, should be examined and the final version should be uh, approved uh, and the fourth uh, step it translated uh, the final version translated from the target language to the original language again it is feedback translation two or two or more freelance uh, other other translators have, should should translate from this and interview validity. Uh, my, here is, uh, my, the, is uh, the part one of my uh, presentation and I will uh, tell you about some things uh, um, after uh, your uh, uh, discussion about the um, um, standard Mizrach questionnaire. And I ask uh, at first for, uh, from my friend Dr. Danish Far uh, from Iran, please uh, tell your opinion about this standard uh, questionnaire and I will uh, uh, present the second uh, part after uh, hearing the uh, viewpoints of our colleagues from Iran and India and other countries. Okay. Thank you very much Dr. Mojadi for your nice uh, presentation. Uh, as we, ha we have discussed uh, this very critical and important point uh, with our colleagues uh, from India and other countries, uh, uh, all of us know that uh, we are not in a good and acceptable uh, situation regarding the Mizaj research because of the uh, very various and disparate methodology of Mizaj research uh, in our countries and we have to unify and standardize our research method and as you uh, mention it and emphasize on this important point uh, in this uh, lecture, uh, we have to accept this uh, uh, point and this issue that uh, this is not acceptable more. Just, just to use our own method of uh, misage assessment, uh, as we have uh, this uh, general survey regarding all of the published article and paper in the, in the field of misage research, that I think we have to uh, publish it and share it with our colleagues in the Mizaj research website uh, soon. Uh, we come to know that uh, most of these papers are not uh, using a standard methodology regarding the Mizaj assessment. Uh, some papers and some colleagues in, uh, in India especially uh, have a ba j j just assess the Mizaj on their own experience and uh, on their own uh, special uh, uh, methodology. Of course, some of them have used some questionnaires, but uh, the point is that these questionnaires uh, are not standardized and uh, they are not a, uh, a standard methodology of preparing a, a standard questionnaire with a very it's, it's, it's statistical evaluations that we have now and we are coming to get more involved uh, with this method in, uh, in this, of course, lecture and in future lectures. So the point is that, in summary, we have to prepare uh, standard questionnaires for misage assessment and share it with our colleagues in different countries and just, just to use these unified and standard questionnaires to be used in uh, different studies from now. Uh, just with this goal that just just to 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 produce uh, reliable and standard evidence in the field of misage and or misage standard uh, misage assessment in your research should be from now should be standardized based on a standard and unified methodology just to be comparable or different studies or different papers that are going to be published in future should should obey unified method, a standard method, just to be comparable, just to be uh, pulled together for, in, inshallah, in future for uh, systematic reviews and meta-analyses. So uh, thank you again, Dr. Mojadi, for your, uh, I think, your great effort in this scientific, uh, uh, in this uh, scientific battle, I think. <laughs> I have to go this battle 
just just to just to put forward the standard method for all of our colleagues. And uh, as I mentioned in the uh, in the chat with some of our colleagues, uh, we are going to introduce these standard questionnaires uh, in future lecture, of course, and share it with our uh, our colleagues in the Misage Research website just to be used uh, by, by other colleagues. Of course, we have to get get the opinions and comments uh, of other colleagues from other countries, from South Africa. Professor Rashid Bikha just joined us. Other colleagues from India. Uh, of course, we know that they have their own experience in the misage assessment. But but the point is that we have to all of us. We have to all obey a unified a standard methodology in misage assessment. Thank you very much, Dr. Mujahid. We are. We have Thank you very much, Dr. Nishpar. Uh, welcome, uh, dear Professor Dr. Rashid Bikha from South Africa. How are you? Are you fine, uh, uh, Professor? Please uh, uh, tell your opinion about this uh, uh, conversation. Sir, can you hear me now? Yes. Look, I, yeah. Alhamdulillah, I'm so pleased. And yes, working together as a team to finalize you know, a document will be an excellent idea. You know, so I think from my side, I'll be very pleased just to load our, our current one and then, of course, obtain feedback. This is how we can all work together and achieve, inshallah, what will be best for all of us. Inshallah. Inshallah, inshallah. Uh, other colleague, uh, dear Dr. Farooq from Aligar, or you have any opinion, please? Well, Dr. Mujahidi, uh, it was a very wonderful presentation. And uh, I don't see a reason why this questionnaire is not being used in India. Uh, you have put a lot of hard work into this, uh, preparing this questionnaire. And uh, though I have some uh, reservations uh, regarding uh, some parts of it, but I think overall uh, it is a questionnaire which we can all work out, work out and work together on it. And finally, uh, I think uh, there, we should be given a chance, uh, especially the Indian researchers should use this questionnaire for some, for some time, so that uh, they will also you know, use it in the field and uh, if there are any uh, um, pros and cons, they, they will be uh, you know, evident with time. Uh, the, there are certain parts of this questionnaire which are, uh, you know, which are to be filled by the participant himself, by the individual himself. And uh, 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 actually, uh, there are certain, uh, you know, parameters of uh, mizaj which are to be assessed by the physician himself. So a, a, a part of it is given to to the to the participant. Uh, so there may be some, you know, some weaknesses to that part. Uh, but if it is a self-filled questionnaire, I think that is also scientifically scientifically acceptable. And overall, it is, uh, I think, uh, a very uh, good questionnaire. And uh, we all should try to, you know, use it in India also, so that we can all have a uniform, uh, you know, methodology for assessment of the mizaj. And uh, as you already said, that uh, this questionnaire is mainly in the Persian language. And after it is translated in English and Urdu, definitely uh, I don't see a reason why we, uh, why the whole global community of Inani medicine uh, should not use it. I think overall it was very nice, Mujahidi. It was nice uh, seeing this questionnaire. And thank you very much. Okay. Thank you very much. Um, uh, inshallah, we will um, um, arrange a team for translation. Um, um, each questionnaire uh, uh, is um, um, uh, in India a standard questionnaire, uh, of course. Uh, we are ready to translate to the Persian and use in Iran it. Uh, and uh, we are ready to, uh, by co cooperation with uh, Indian colleagues uh, and uh, English professor teachers, uh, to translate um, uh, the Persian language questionnaire to Engli lo local English in India language uh, for uh, practice in India for the research and uh, other uh, use. Uh, and inshallah, in the next uh, month, we will arrange from uh, um, uh, Babur University of Medical Science, in Babur University of Medical Science, we will arrange uh, a workshop uh, for uh, uh, about uh, teaching uh, about the uh, um, design, uh, the steps of design and validation of 
a standard questionnaire for um, for our colleagues, and this is uh, the, this this workshop is is um, um, a due webinar, and uh, our teachers, uh, our professors, uh, that they are experienced in the uh, psychometric, they are epidemiologists and a statistic man that we work with them more than 10 years and they are experts in uh, the, the designing and validation and analysis methods for a standardization of a questionnaire and we will have we will have uh, this workshop in the next uh, month and we'll inform all co colleagues in the uh, whatsapp group inshallah um, and uh, mm, uh, I, um, um, we, we are ready to uh, uh, cooperate with each other. Of course, I, it needs to tell uh, to all colleagues, the questionnaire isn't the, the, the true diagnosis, the exact diagnosis isn't. The exact diagnosis is the experience of the Hakim, experience of physician. And uh, the questionnaire is the tool for the, the tool helping the research to arrange the research and to help the uh, students and young physicians to diagnose in the uh, clinic, um, as all of you know. Uh, thank you very much, Dr. Farouk. Uh, other colleagues from other uh, um, uh, universities, please uh, um, 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 turn on your uh, microphone and uh, tell us your uh, good opinions. Is there any opinion from my dear colleagues from indecision? Okay. Doctor uh, Zaidi from Bhopal, please tell me, tell you, tell that uh, us your opinion. Please uh, open your microphone. Turn on. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks a lot. Assalamu alaikum, everyone. Uh, I think it was a very uh, wonderful presentation, which was uh, covering a lot of, uh, uh, you know, research-based information, and uh, it, you know, highlighted the need of uh, uh, validating these uh, diagnostic yeah. tools, be it the Mizaj or uh, other diagnostic tools. We have to work uh, um, uh, these fundamental uh, diagnostic tools, which are available in our uh, system of medicine. Uh, because unless and until we are having a, a standard tool, uh, we cannot, uh, you know, generalize our results and we cannot uh, convince the scientific community that yes, uh, our uh, data is just, uh, you know, it's conforming uh, to the principles of the Unani system of medicine and uh, so uh, I congratulate you for taking this initiative and organizing this kind of uh, workshops and webinars. And I, and I hope I'm very much positive that uh, something fruitful will uh, definitely uh, come, out of, come out of this. So all of my best wishes are with you. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. Uh, 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 other colleagues, uh, of, um, we um, eagerly uh, are ready to hear your opinions. Is there any question about the uh, questionnaires and uh, the um, the um, problems in the, your university for uh, the designing and standardization of the questionnaire about the diagnosis in the Yunnan medicine? Maybe Nizaj and other things in the um, Yunnan medicine. Um, um, I think in, in most of our university, especially in India, um, there isn't any good relationship between methodologies and epidemiologists uh, and psychometrics between uh, um, Yunani medicine colleagues and uh, these uh, specialists. Yeah. Excuse me, Dr. Mojadi. Uh, just let me uh, add this point. Uh, as many of our colleagues just. Uh, asked for uh, sharing the these questionnaires. Uh, I think uh, we have to uh, just just announce that 
uh, all of the applicable and standard questionnaires uh, could be uh, available on the message research website and of course uh, once again I have to uh, just uh, remind that we, we have to we have to we have to make a, a focal point group a focal group just just to preparing and standard standardizing the these questionnaire and share them uh, through website or the uh, whatsapp group with our colleagues and of course as you mentioned uh, we have to assess that uh, which languages should be used in the uh, different regions and just just to scientifically and methodologically translate these questionnaires uh, that previously have been prepared uh, based on the standard methods uh, just just translate them as you mentioned uh, based on that uh, special steps uh, to the local languages uh, for example local English language uh, in the India or the Urdu or Indian uh, language or other language that should, that is going to be used by the researchers at that uh, special regions so uh, we have to make this uh, a specialized uh, focal group for preparing the sure. research questionnaires and share them with the colleagues. Yeah, my colleagues are presenting their uh, message research website that will be put uh, um, the questionnaires inside the website, but unfortunately um, we don't translate them to the English. And uh, as I mentioned, uh, we need to uh, translate in the scientific method and it needs a, wo a teamwork for translation to other uh, language. Um, here is the um, uh, the, uh, the articles and the original uh, format of the questionnaires and the, the um, uh, refer reference uh, articles uh, in the um, message research website. And inshallah, in the future, after translating to other uh, language, Arabic, English, Indian, Urdu, uh, and other language, we will put the, uh, the um, translated uh, questionnaire inside the message research. Um, uh, I emphasize, if, is, the, if, is there any uh, uh, standard questionnaire in the, any country, in the Sri Lanka, in the Bangladesh, in the India, in the... South Africa and other countries that work in and medicine, um, uh, we, we are ready to translate it to the Persia and use uh, them in the, our researches in Iran. Um, uh, here is the message research part of a questionnaire and we are designed all uh, needs uh, for standard scales to diagnosis the disease, the uh, Sue message disease the uh, message as organ message as a the message uh, well, yeah, primary um, message uh, um, we are uh, designing some project in our university uh, and here i present you uh, i present you man, uh, we present uh, uh, our team here uh, i uh, show you some uh, picture about our team in Iran. We have more than 30 uh, people, uh, near about uh, 25 uh, Persian medicine specialists and uh, five methodologists, expert methodologists. All of them are uh, faculty of university members. Uh, from uh, um, 10 years ago, until now, uh, we have um, regular um, sessions, discussion groups, expert panel, and um, I, I will put or um, um, uh, publish article about the um, results of our uh, projects. Uh, at the first step, we uh, have a, um, a hybrid method uh, um, analytic um, um, research and uh, uh, design a major and minor criteria of Mizaj or Aza and um, uh, we will send um, to uh, the group, WhatsApp group the, uh, their articles inside the WhatsApp group. Here in the here is a, a University of Shahid Beshti um, um, in Tehran and we have sometimes we have more than three day 
uh, uh, spontaneously uh, um, and um, regular sentences pushed to Sana. A continuous uh, session uh, from morning until night, uh, more than 10 hours per day discussion group for um, uh, challenging and uh, um, discussion about each one by one uh, concepts, one by one indices. One by one criteria. Here is, for example, it is a, a, the, the professor of the artist science in Iran. He is a statistic and, and a veteran is supervisor of the project, supervisor of the and, and uh, ex Oh, sorry, uh, uh, my, my net uh, caught it, and again, I tell you, uh, sorry, uh, I tell you my presentation, presentation, is there my presentation, is it? Yeah, I will present again. Okay, and uh, um, Presentation, okay. And uh, here is the state of, uh, for example, is the state of uh, visits of uh, volunteers. Um, more than ten specialists visit the uh, volunteers and write their uh, exact diagnosis about each criteria of measures. For example, about the malmass, about the lawn uh, color, about the uh, other things. Um, independently, separately, and we uh, analyze their agreements. Uh, as you know, we uh, we published uh, some of result of these uh, projects. Uh, and here, for example, we have some workshops from some workshop uh, by participation more than uh, f uh, for. Uh, 40 um, uh, student and uh, uh, faculty member, and here the professor um, uh, Zarayan uh, are presenting uh, method of design and standardization of the uh, standard tools. And here we we uh, we uh, have some session out of the Tehran because the team. Uh, should uh, focus on their work without any relationship with their family, with their work, with their mobile phone and other things, because they need to focus on the um, project and have some sessions and some um, uh, visit uh, um, uh, sessions uh, outside the city in the uh, in the uh, um, uh, hospital uh, out of the city and um, they focus on their work of, um, without any relationship with other uh, class sessions, uh, their family, uh, yeah. And uh, for example, here is the um, um, end memory of the uh, one project uh, about the standardization of the uh, questionnaire uh, in the Shahid Beishtin University of Medical Science. Uh, and uh, all of these people are the faculty members of the uh, Tehran University, Shahid Beishtin University, Babul University, 
um, and um, um, uh, inshallah we will publish our results and uh, we will uh, offer uh, the uh, questionnaires and uh, uh, inshallah um, all um, scientists cent scientific centers and scientific project um, could use them and inshallah we will establish the basis of measures according to the evidence-based medicine inshallah uh, I finished uh, my presentation and uh, I would like to hear uh, from our colleagues uh, your opinions. Uh, uh, of course, we don't have enough time, but uh, I eagerly um, um, want to uh, hear your good uh, uh, opinions. I'm at your service, my colleagues. If I could, yes. Uh, if I could come in one minute. Uh, so yeah, look, uh, Alhamdulillah, I'm so pleased with so much work that you've been done. It's, it's absolutely amazing, you know, the contribution that, that, that from the Iran is making. Now from my side, inshallah, within the next two days, but from by data Wednesday, I'll send you, I'll send on to the, for loading onto the website, all the work that we've done. And then of course, if we can share this, and again, yeah, we are open to any discussion, any, you know, pros and cons, et cetera. That's the only way we can work together. Alhamdulillah, inshallah, we can perfect this quite so. Inshallah. So once again, thank you so much for you for organizing this, this group. Alhamdulillah. Well done. Alhamdulillah. You are all of it. Jazakallah khair. Thank you very much, Professor Rashid Bihar. And uh, thank you all uh, my colleagues uh, that participate in this session. Um, and inshallah, with the help of each other together, all our centers and all people uh, in the Yunnan and Persian medicine, we will <coughs> arrange a, um, a um, good uh, system for diagnosis and treatment according to Yunnan and Persian medicine. And, we ex uh, export to our uh, school to the all countries in the world, inshallah, and expand this uh, school, inshallah, in the other countries. Thank you very much, and have a good time. Uh, dear Dr. Danishwar, uh, do you have any uh, comments? Thank you very much uh, for your presentation, uh, Dr. Mujahidi. I really appreciate your effort. And of course, uh, I would like to thank all of the participants that join us in this meeting today uh, from different countries uh, and uh, I would like to just just to share or uh, the the evidences the papers questionnaire standard questionnaire with our colleagues and just to see in future inshallah uh, uh, standard uh, researches and the standard published uh, papers based on these questionnaires inshallah to, to just to expand and the introduce the, uh, this school of medicine scientifically in other uh, uh, scientific communities. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. I ask uh, anyone before uh, uh, leaving the session, please write your exact name and your affiliation and your university in your city or country because we are arranged a list of uh, participation of each um, session, each webinar, I maybe we uh, send them a um, um, certificate for um, maybe, maybe, uh, maybe we could uh, send them um, the certification from Babel University of Medical Science. Please write your exact name, your country, affiliation, your university. Um, maybe we could, uh, we can arrange the um, certificate. Thank you very much and uh, have a good time. Inshallah, we uh, in the next month we uh, will be at your service with another research. Inshallah. And I um, um, graduately uh, will put, uh, you uh, will send our um, 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 articles about uh, standardization of the basis of mesage uh, in the WhatsApp group. And uh, inshallah, we will discuss and um, 
a, a response to your uh, question in the WhatsApp group in the uh, next days, inshallah. <coughs> Uh, thank you everyone and uh, have a good time. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. Khuda hafiz.